Change is needed within the Minneapolis Police Department. That is a resounding theme from feedback collected at several community and officer engagement sessions and just released. The meetings last fall were part of a state consent decree over a pattern uh, and practice of racial discrimination at the department. WCCO's Jennifer Merrily has the first look at the data and what it means. And each year the training has to be reviewed. Hundreds showed up to community engagement sessions to share their experiences with Minneapolis police on things like use of force, stops, searches and arrests, plus mission, vision and values. Officers also participated in their own sessions and the results are in. We need policy changes. We need um, accountability. We need community engagement and we need it now. Commander Yolanda Wilkes oversees the implementation unit formed to carry out the state mandated reform. It's just heightened because over time, if we have the same problem, the same problem persists and no change is occurring. And I think it was just more so emphasized. Officers pointed out the need for transparent and coherent policies, easily accessible training and streamlined communication channels. It seemed like there was a lot of confusion surrounding what officers are being asked to do in the community. Yes, I agree. I agree that there's a lot of confusion. And that can lead to discrepancies in training and then with interactions in the community. It tells us that we have an existing problem. In the culturally specific engagement sessions. A team worked on gathering input. Kevin Carlisle helped engage the community. And I think that it goes back to generation trauma. And Brendan LaFranchi worked to compile the feedback. There's that strong drive that community should be first and foremost when we're considering any of these changes because that is who the police department serves. Now that the data is clear, they say the next step is to start developing policies that will go through a review process. One policy change could take up to a year and that just tells you how thorough the process is. It doesn't become effective until every officer has been trained on that policy. Jennifer Merrily, WCCO News. The full session analysis is online at WCCO.com. MPD says it wants to hear from you if you'd like to learn more about what is in those reports. By request, they will attend community meetings and share the findings.